Hi everyone and welcome back to some more Civilization 6. So, let's continue where we left off. And I think we should wait a little bit with that war. Because the Cossack is actually a pretty strong unit. With 67 base strength. That's actually higher than the Rifleman. So, I'm thinking we need more upgraded units. Let's just wait at least a few more turns and we'll see what happens. I don't want to rush too much. I'm actually surprised how many they recruited. They have, what, three cities left? Maybe four. Yeah, how many cities do you have? Let's have a look. Oh, actually, he has more than I thought. All right. That's fine. I still want his capital, don't get me wrong. Also, kill these stupid barbarians. Shouldn't take too long now. Hopefully. And another thing is that I think we should spam more Outback stations. Apparently I've not done it nearly enough. So we'll do that once we get more builders. And he started a city. I expected as much. We'll just brace that city once we go to war. But not yet. All right. So kill these dudes. They are getting on my nerves. As much as I'd like to finish him off, if we attack with the pikemen, the pikemen will probably die to the crossbowmen. So, how about we don't do that? Right, we need to repair the pasture, but let's not move too close. And the trade route. Maybe we should go for some production. That certainly wouldn't hurt. Also, we could actually speed up the wonder by getting a few outback stations. Let's just buy a builder. Why the heck not? He will get six builds. I would say that's worth it. And we still got one more on this dude. I'll probably wait for combustion to improve the oil, since we'll have to do that eventually anyway. Well, he killed I himself. I guess that works. And we got a promotion. Nice. We leaped for the Which one do we want? People need the use of Plus 7 combat strength when defending creative. versus ranged attacks. Yep. We can pick that up. And the builder. So, I think we'll just use all 6 builds for outback stations. That seems reasonable get some more production. Probably replace the farm as well. Yep, I think so. That will help production. And how much extra production can we get from a trade route? Plus three. Okay, that's not amazing. But I might still grab it anyway. We can get plus two production, plus seven gold. Plus one science if we send the trader to China. I don't plan declaring war on China anymore, so let's just go for it. Eight turns to finish a university. Gorgo is still ahead of us in science. I don't like that too much. And how many units are there in here? Way too many. Well, hopefully one unit will be enough to handle all these barbarians. But it's getting a bit out of hand. So, production. What do we want in here? I suppose more builders wouldn't hurt. Yeah, let's grab a few more builders. And more outback stations. Just need to remove improvement first. We should probably also just buy the grassland to the southwest. This one. And I think I'll do that. It will be kind of expensive, but probably worth it. So, there's the second rifleman, nice. And let's just finish that water mill, why not? And we'll see.
Do you also have a catapult nearby? Two catapults nearby. Okay, that's way too many units. I might have to back up and heal. Well, they don't do a lot of damage, but there might be more units inside the fog. So let's just back up a little bit and heal up for a turn or two. Let them come to us and we can attack with the pikemen. More shade routes. Let's see. Let's just go for the gold. Yep, sounds good to me. And more outback stations. That should help quite a bit. It will help both cities in the long run, since we can just switch these tiles around and work them with it one city or the other, depending nations, on our needs. And not the other way right, so as much as I dislike just spending 365 gold on a tile with nothing, we'll grab it anyway. And get another oh. outback station. And then one more. This is a district, so I can't replace that. Right, what's the next Civic going to be? Let's have a look. Civil Engineering, probably. Yeah, I think so. Especially since that leads to urbanization. Sounds good. Yeah, even more barbarians. They are sending a caravel, too. Okay, then. That is sadly annoying. Can we repair this yet? Where are they coming from? From here. Alright, that explains it. Nice try, but I don't think so, buddy. Let's just sleep this builder or something. And one more. There, that will help production quite a bit. We can grab one more. Actually, will that really help? 36 production. Yeah, we'll finish the Wonder in 10 turns. Hopefully no one will beat us to it. Because I really want that one. And we got steel, so now we can get artillery. Very nice. Let's just upgrade right away. We still got professional army, I think. Yes, we do. Upgrade, upgrade. And maybe we should create some cords. But not with two experienced units. That would be a bit of a waste. Yeah, we could use some inexperienced field cannons from elsewhere. But we can certainly merge the riflemen. That's definitely a good idea. And we will do that. And probably the pikemen, but perhaps later. Two mazemen, three mazemen. Okay, this is getting slightly out of hand. We need to back up. Yep, we need to back up, otherwise we'll lose units. And that would be bad. I might need some help over there. But there are no other units nearby. Anyway, research. Scientific theory. It's already boosted. And it's required for chemistry. I don't think we'll be building two neighborhoods anytime soon. Extract an artifact. I might do that. Also, own free masked men to get a boost for replaceable parts. I don't think we can do that. We can't recruit Masked Men anymore. Well, that's disappointing. But okay. I guess we'll just research that the hard way. But first, scientific theory, since that's already boosted. We'll see once we finish that. And you need so let's grab a field cannon. And we'll use it to create cores. Works for me. We got one more build. How about we use it 
for an outback station somewhere around here. Is there any unused tile or unimproved tile somewhere around here? I'm sure there is somewhere. Oh yeah, we could get a farm or two. I suppose that's a good idea. And the trailer out again. Yeah, 20 gold, 8 culture. We'll definitely go for that one. City walls are almost done. These barbarians are really getting on my nerves by now. Well, we need to wait a turn or two to deal with them. Unfortunately. Alright, if that's what we have to do, that's what we'll do. So, merge these guys. That's much better. 24 base melee strength. But I would still like to get a few more units before we declare war. Maybe at least one more, the field cannon. Okay, I'm really strongly considering just bringing more units to deal with these barbarians. Let's see if we can lure them towards us. That would be useful. Oh yeah, should we merge the artillery? Maybe? I don't think it's worth it, really. They already have some experience. It's not amazing experience, but... I'd rather use completely fresh artillery units for that. You think we're a warmonger? We haven't declared any wars in a long time. No idea why you would think that. Okay, four macemen now. Seriously? Yeah, okay. Well, one down. But this is going to take a while. Most likely. Longer than I expected. Meanwhile, Russia will be recruiting more units. Maybe we should just focus on Gorgo. I mean, the Russian capital is right next to our territory. We can just take it anytime we want. So perhaps going after Russia is a bit of a waste of resources. And Gorgo's science output is still improving. I think we should go after Gorgo instead of attacking Russia. That seems like a much better idea. Seriously though, these stupid barbarians. Let's send a unit or two, because I have a feeling that will take way too long otherwise. They are not giving up. They are actually attacking our city now. Roads, Seriously? But the crooked roads without improvement All right. are roads of genius. If that's what you want to do, I can play that game. We almost repaired the industrial zone. Don't let it get pillaged again. In fact, let's maybe not finish repairing it yet. We can start recruiting something. Because I don't want it to get pillaged immediately after repairing it. That would be kind of really bad. So how about we get started on flight? That seems like a pretty good idea to me. Yeah, let's get flight. I wouldn't mind some observation balloons. And what about civics? Urbanization? Colonialism would give us two envoys. And I'll probably want an archaeologist at some point. Right, production. Let's grab a builder. We still need a lot of improvements around here. And a new policy. Which one was that? That was serfdom. 
So we'll grab public works. Especially since we are recruiting quite a few builders right now. And I'll be keeping professional army for now. How's that wonder coming along? We need four more turns. Watch someone beat us to it right before it's finished. <laughs> that wouldn't surprise me too much. But hopefully that's not going to happen. Gorgo doesn't seem to care too much about wonders. And she's the most advanced sieve right now. So, yeah, hopefully we won't get any competition. Let's see. Well, I'm glad I got that builder nearby. Because we got some tiles that require repairs. Should be safe to finish repairing the industrial zone now. Yep, sounds good. Trade route to Laventa. And I'm just going to focus on Gorgo. What's her military strength? 1200. That is quite a lot. I don't know what kinds of units she has exactly. We should try to scout her out a little bit. See what kinds of units we can expect. Okay, this is just way too many barbarians now. But it's going to take way too long bringing that field cannon over there. Yeah, it's just not worth it. It will take forever to get there. We'll have to handle it with what we have. More production. Another builder. Yeah. We can just spam some outback stations, if nothing else. Should have done it earlier, probably, but better late than never, right? And how's the university? Is it done yet? Yeah, it's done. So how's the science output? 170 on Gorgo. Yeah, okay. Which era is she in? She's in atomic era, actually. All right. This might be interesting. And she has a lot of cities. Is she at war with anyone? Yeah, still at war with China. It's weird that she didn't manage to conquer any Chinese cities with all that military strength. I'm not quite sure what's going on there. It's not like China has an army to defend itself with. It doesn't. So what's going on with all that military strength? Well, I guess we'll find out soon enough, probably. Okay, this is really getting annoying now. That might have been a mistake right there. Okay, carry on. Wait, why can I not continue the production queue? I guess we'll do one turn of the trader. And chop the jungle. The catapult is still incoming as well. Wait, they the healed back to fall, really? Is built along a central All right. Axis, the axis of the world. At least we got the Forbidden City. So that's nice. But that stupid crossbowman just healed back to fall. And he's dead. <laughs> that didn't help you, did it? Alright, so next up the catapults. And a policy. Which policy do we want? Good question. Maybe something that will help with unit recruitment? Yeah, probably. Looks good to me. Or maybe science? Yeah, actually, let's grab rationalism. 128. So we caught up to Gorgo, but she's still working on her science output. I don't like that. What's next? Probably a factory. 
This is our top production city now, isn't it? It should be. And if not, it's going to be second top. Same trade route as before. Now, the question is, how long do we want to wait before declaring war on Gorgo? I'm still not quite sure what exactly to expect. It's a little bit strange. I wouldn't mind getting an observation balloon for the artillery, but that will take a little bit too long to finish. I don't think we can afford to wait that long. Probably not. I'll have to think about it. Can we get any other easy unit upgrades soon? Well, we could get combustion. Remember that politics, colonialism, we aren't quite close to getting the digger just yet. Also originated in the human brain. We can get chemistry. Might be worth waiting for chemistry, actually. Maybe. Not sure. I'll have to think about it. It would be easier to decide if I knew what exactly to expect from Gorgo. It's very strange that she didn't conquer any Chinese cities while having all that military strength. No idea what she's doing. It's very suspicious. Anyway, policies. So should we go for natural history or urbanization? We are building an archaeological museum, so I suppose natural history makes sense. And envoy. How's Amsterdam doing? Okay, we are not being threatened in there. And our other city? We aren't being threatened here either. Let's work on some new city then, shall we? Which one would that be? Let's have a look. 11, not that one. Actually, we can see that number over here. Lisbon, only three. Is the bonus actually useful for us? What's the bonus? Your trader units are immune to being plundered on water tiles. Not super useful. But... I guess we could grab the city? Yeah, sure. Why the heck not? It's only one envoy after all. And none of the other city-states would be easy to get. Unfortunately, 9, 11, 12, 9. I guess we should just focus on the 4 that we control. Or 3 that we control. So I'll keep the envoys that we have. In case someone actually challenges us for control of the city-state. Right, I guess the catapults will be the easy part. But this still took way longer than it should have. And we still have to get rid of the actual barbarian camp. I will do that. So, chop the jungle. Not much point bringing the pikeman because he will die almost instantly. We'll just keep them inside the cities. What do you want? Can we get a decent trade? Let's have a look. Luxury for a luxury? That is not a decent trade. Not even remotely close. Sorry. Another builder is done. And let's see. Let's maybe grab a district or a factory. I guess that's a good idea. And another factory. Or maybe an arena. We are at minus one amenities. Arena first and then a factory. That works. Another mace man. Seriously now? Alright. You know, I'm spending more time fighting barbarians than I spent fighting actual AIs. <laughs> or at least they are putting up more of a fight than the actual AIs did. Which is a bit sad, I have to say.
Anyway, can we get any Outback stations adjacent to pastures? I'm not seeing any. Over here. With the other builder, alright. I guess that's what we'll do. Should we replace whatever this is, a lumber mill? Probably not worth it now, but we'll get to Outback stations on the adjacent tiles. And this guy? Well, we'll still grab a station. That's two for two production. Still decent. Don't you worry, we'll have war soon enough. Well, that amazement almost killed itself. Thanks for your cooperation. Because I'd like to be done with this already. <laughs> anyway, I'm going to make a cut here and continue in the next part. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time.